It's green, it's clean, and it can do 150 miles an hour. It's a battery-powered Mini that's been designed and built in Hampshire. And what's more, it can drive for 900 miles before it comes to a stop, removing the biggest problem that has troubled previous electric cars. Is a little company from Alton about to change the face of motoring? Well, here's our transport correspondent, Paul Clifton, to tell us. That is about reinventing the wheel. Inside each wheel is a separate electric motor. The power for that comes from here, a bank of lithium batteries. But each time the wheel breaks, that energy is stored and put back into the batteries. In the back of the car is a very small petrol engine, smaller than a motorbike's, and that generates more power for the battery. Critically, it gives this car a range of 900 miles. That gets round the big problem with other battery cars that take a long time to recharge. It's been investigated by a number of major car manufacturers already, and every one of them has come back and claims this to be the most advanced electric drivetrain system in the world. This Mini matches any supercar, 0 to 60, in four seconds. I think that probably in the next four to five years, probably 25% of all new vehicles manufactured worldwide will have some form of electric drivetrain. Inside, there's no gearbox, no clutch, just three buttons, park, drive, and reverse. And this car can go just as fast backwards as forwards. Inside the wheel, microcomputers process 4,000 calculations a second. The wheel can think for itself. It's being developed with the University of Portsmouth. It's artificial intelligence. It's what's called neural networks. And these neural networks uh, learn as, you, as you're driving, just like we do. Then it makes sure the car doesn't get into a skid or you haven't got excessive body roll. It's early days. The car's not moving yet. It will hit the test track later this summer. Paul Clifton, BBC South Today, Alton.